I spent the day in the shade of a tree Thinking how we best spend this precious time that we've been given Refreshing water In this episode, we are visiting the Ntong Chai Waterfalls, one of Hong Kong's four natural wonders. Traveling with veteran climber Zhang Zhang, we began our journey from Taipo's Ntong Chai village. Passing through the Mantak Yun Taoist Temple, it takes around two hours on an uphill hike to enjoy the view of the four main waterfalls. They include the Bottom Fall, Middle Fall, Main Fall, and the Scatter Fall. While the weather is nice and the sun is out, it's not too sunny today. There are many vines along the way to the waterfall, and it feels like we're inside a tropical rainforest. We are surrounded by the color green. Coming up, the first stop. We can hear the sound of water nearby. And here we are. We reached the bottom fall after a 20-minute hike from Mantak Yun Temple. Everywhere you look, you can find a maze of trees. Tilting your head upwards is like staring at the sky from the bottom of a well. The bottom fall is the deepest out of the four main waterfalls in Ntong Chai. The ground is also covered with moss, so be extra careful when you're here. Zhang said the patterned sole on the bottom of the shoe will definitely help with gripping on the floor even after being in the water. The middle fall is just a stone's throw away. What does this view make you imagine of? Right behind me is the middle fall, nicknamed the ponytail fall, as the water spreads open at the bottom part. But whether it truly resembles a ponytail is up to the viewers to decide. As spectacular as the middle fall is, let's hope we can find some hidden caves under the main fall. It takes quite some leg muscle to reach the main fall since it's 100 meters higher than the middle fall. We hear the sound of gushing water again. In 30 minutes, we are standing right in front of the main fall. The area here is open and free. Standing right here beneath a 30-meter-tall waterfall and accompanied by a dash of wind and rain is actually very chilly. During the summer, visitors can see more powerful surges from the waterfall. But as Zhang has witnessed many accidents while hiking in the past, he urges everyone to pay extra attention to safety when taking photos here. Part of the top of the main fall is the scatter fall. Years ago, the Agriculture, Fisheries and Conservation Department fenced the area, but a significant number of people still climb over the fence these days. But remember, stay away from the waterfall during bad weather. And be careful while taking photos because it's easy to lose your balance and get hurt here. We were originally going to hike up to Scatterfall, but as the road to our final stop is under repair at the moment, we had to end our journey at the main fall. Each waterfall at Ntong Chai has its unique qualities. While they may not be comparable to other internationally well-known waterfalls, we can feel the force of nature up close with the waterfalls here in Hong Kong. See you next time on Walkie Walkie.